Niobium batteries, a Brazilian invention that promises to be the solution for battery technologies. Hi engineering fans, I'm Igor Felipe. And today we're going to talk about a recent development in battery technologies, which is the use of niobium in their manufacturing. But after all, what is niobium? Niobium is a chemical element identified by the symbol NB. It is found in group 5 of the periodic table and has an atomic number of 41 and an atomic mass of 92.9. The metal was discovered in 1801 by English chemist Charles Hatchett through studies of the mineral columbite. At the time, he named the new element he found columbium. Later, in 1846 independently, the German chemist Heinrich Rose discovered the element and named it niobium, a name adopted by the international community starting in 1950. But it was only in the mid 20th century that the element started to gain more prominence. That's because niobium has the ability to transform the properties of other materials. This means that niobium has countless uses, such as in cars, aircraft turbines, magnetic resonance imaging machines, pacemaker devices, rockets, electronic components, and now also in batteries. Today, the metal is mainly used in special alloys mixed with other metals such as steel, titanium, or copper. This blend of materials increases the final product's mechanical strength. A great example is the use of niobium in pipeline tubes, where mixing steel with niobium even in a small percentage greatly increases the mechanical strength of these tubes. However, since the use of the metal is very specific, the demand for its use is also limited. In this way, niobium is at the same time strategic from a technological point of view, but still not highly valued. So it's necessary to create more uses for this metal with such interesting properties. And that's where the Brazilian niobium battery comes in, which, if it's as powerful as promised, could prove to be an excellent use and revolutionize the energy storage market. And just so you have an idea if the niobium battery takes off, this will be excellent news for us Brazilians, since niobium practically only exists here in Brazil, where we have almost 98% of the world's reserves. But if this niobium is so good, why haven't we gotten rich from extracting it? This is because niobium is a substitutable metal. This means that although it has good properties, it can be replaced by metals with similar characteristics. Another detail that hurts the commercialization of niobium is the fact that we sell niobium as a raw material, that is raw niobium, and not as a product that uses niobium in its composition. Now, with this idea of building a battery made of niobium, we end up adding value to a product. In other words, we don't export the raw material, but rather a technology produced here. That way, when we use the metal in other technologies, like batteries, we also add value to its extraction and production chain of niobium. But what are the advantages of niobium? Niobium's main advantages are its high thermal and electrical conductivity. Ductility, which is the ability of the material to undergo deformation without losing its physical characteristics, malleability and high resistance to heat, wear and corrosion. These characteristics end up giving the metal the ability to enhance physical properties, making the metals that are alloyed with niobium more efficient. And it's because of these characteristics that niobium has several ways in which it can be applied. For example, niobium is essential for technological innovations, focusing on the development of smarter and more resistant materials, making them lighter, increasing performance, efficiency, and safety. This benefits the mobility sector, enabling the creation of orthopedic processes for people with advanced technology. And not only that, because niobium helps solve engineering challenges, enabling material savings and efficiency. Projects with more modern structures can have more design freedom with greater strength and in a more sustainable way. That's because with the use of niobium, we can increase the strength characteristics of materials and this opens up possibilities to improve calculations and optimize structures. Niobium is a wealth of Brazil with a great need for better appreciation and use. And the investment of two major companies in battery technology sets an important precedent for the future of the country's economy. But then, 
Who actually developed this niobium battery? This achievement should be credited to Volkswagen trucks and buses in partnership with the Brazilian metallurgy and mining company, who signed an agreement to develop and manufacture niobium-based batteries for electric vehicles. According to the teams from both companies, one of the advantages of this Brazilian technology is that it allows electric cars to be charged in a record time of up to six minutes. Charging an electric car as quickly as refueling a gas car is an unprecedented achievement. The project is expected to elevate Brazil's position in the automotive sector thanks to the partnership between the vehicle manufacturer and the Companhia Brasileira de Metalurgia e Mineração. And if you don't know, Companhia Brasileira de Metalurgia e Mineração extracts niobium and develops new technologies with it. This project is the result of almost four years of research in Japan and also involves several technologies from Toshiba. To help you understand better, niobium is used in batteries, replacing graphite. This allows them to be half the size of conventional batteries. But it's important to point out that its energy density is lower than that of conventional electric vehicle batteries, so the vehicle's range will also be lower. That's why a specific charging infrastructure for this technology needs to be implemented, since fast charging is one of the main advantages of the niobium battery. In other words, you might have a shorter range, but fast charging would eliminate that problem. And if you think they're going to be like those disposable batteries we see nowadays, studies show that the niobium battery can have a lifespan of almost 20 years, in more than 10,000 cycles. In comparison, these batteries would have up to five times more cycles than typical lithium-ion batteries. And not only the battery lifespan, but we also have the benefit of safety. Since they don't degrade at extreme temperatures like other batteries, they reduce the risk of fire. Now imagine you're driving an electric car with a Brazilian niobium battery and knowing that you can fully charge it in just six minutes. What do you think? Do you think this trend could catch on around here? Leave your thoughts in the comments. I'll leave two videos that complement this topic and that you might also like, so make sure to click on one of them and check it out. Did you enjoy the video? Leave your like. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. And if you like our work, go ahead and turn on the notification bell. That's it, my friends. A big hug, and I'll see you in the next video.